All right, guys, so as you can see, I have a straight line box and I'm not really sure what it is because I didn't order anything. They weren't supposed to send me anything. So I wanted to unbox this with you guys. So I'm gonna just chop it open real quick and then I'll pick you back up. Okay, Let's see what we got here. And I'm opening it up upside down. So I don't know if this is supposed to be presented the better way. A box inside of a box. What is that? What's this? A hanger. Wow. No way. Let's unravel that. Check that out. FXR Ride Division, and then it's labeled Straight Line Performance and RSI. Wow, that is super, super nice. Thanks, guys. That is uh, actually really, really nice. It's getting worn tonight if it gets cold enough. And then I gotta open this box now. Okay, inside the box that was inside of the box, and then I had to open another box that was inside of that box. So what's in here? Right, new mug, hold my tea in the morning, or a frosty beverage later on in the evening. A straight line RSI snapback hat. Got some new straight line gear. I've actually been meaning to uh, reach out to them and get some gear, so this is all good stuff. So you have a straight line t-shirt like that. Looks like we got another t-shirt. Oh yeah, we got an RSI shirt now. Got a little drawstring bag. Beautiful. Why not leave them more stuff? Looks like we got some brochures about some of the stuff they offer, which I know I've talked about some of the stuff that they offer. And actually, I was getting ready to post this video tonight anyway, so this kind of works out that this stuff all came in. So, guys, if you really need anything, give them a call. If you're uh, getting ready to check out, and I'll put my promo code at the bottom here, but it's Bonaduce2022. Uh, save you a couple pennies when you guys are checking out, but straight line, appreciate you guys, and this is just leading into this video right here, so have fun. What's going on guys and welcome back. So this video is gonna be something quicker and I mentioned it in a video way earlier when I was uh, talking about the straight line performance stuff that I put on my sled. So I actually got two mufflers or as people call them, cans from them. One is the quiet can, which is the one that I run. It's not much louder at all and you save eight pounds. The other one is the ultra light muffler, which is an extremely loud one. And I am by no way, shape or form saying run these because that is what shuts down trails and that's not what we want. But I'm just doing a comparison. It's at Joey's place. It's right in the backyard on the property. property. Yeah, on private property. So I, I, I'm literally just riding this on private property just so you guys can hear the difference of, you know, it's crazy. So this is the ultralight one. And I just put the two uh, springs on up top because I'm only going to just go do a couple pulls in the, in the, in the backyard. Uh, it looks really, really nice, obviously. Fit and finish is just as good as anything else. And then this is the one that I have been running which is, you know, straight line performance is quiet can. And again, straight line performance is not starting line performance. Straight line performance is SPI, straight line is SLP. So it's way different. So um, I just threw this on real quick. We have Joey here on his new links, which you guys have already seen. We have John Doe on his oldie but goodie. Check this out. What year is that? That's a old- 07. 07. So last owner. year. Original owner. How Brand many new. miles? Uh, eleven and a half thousand. Eleven and a half thousand. Brand new motor. Yeah, just put it. Yeah, just put a motor in it. So, uh, we just slap this on. We're gonna do do a couple pulls, and then I'll come in, switch it back to what I am running, and then I'll do a couple pulls on that, just so you guys can hear the difference. But uh, that's it. Here we go. It's loud. We just fired it up before. It's definitely it's noisy here. I'll fire it up now. Not recommend running this on the trail. <laughs> Say it a million times.
Very obnoxious. And just like that, we are back to our quiet can, which is where I will live. Um, if you want a ton of bark and you want to get in trouble and you want some trail closures, that's your man. Uh, if you're out in the mountain and everything with no real laws or if you're going racing or something on a closed course, then that is also your man. But trail-wise, this thing is mint. You guys have heard it before, but I'm going to fire it up for you now. And then I'll go do the same pulls that I just did with that one with this one. Again, you can hear just a little bit of a difference. It's just a different tone is really what it is, but uh, not many decimal louder. I think it's two, maybe three decimals louder than stock. So a um, bunch of weight savings, everything like that, but uh, I'm gonna put side panel on and go do some more pulls. All right, guys, so for whatever reason, and I'm not really sure, when we went back up on top of the hill to video the uh, light muffler, the one that I run, not the ultralight, um, the files got corrupt for whatever reason, and I can't get them back. So I went back in my memory bank and found some videos of the sled running. Some of you guys have probably seen it. It's from the rhythm section when I was with Bruce on the lake. Um, if you guys haven't seen it, it's pretty cool footage, but uh, that's the only footage that I have of it running um i was going to put it up on the stand but it's just not going to sound the same it's probably going to sound louder because it's going to be on the stand you know the stand and it's going to be on blacktop so um i just wanted to throw that in there <laughs> Guys, that's going to do it for this video. Um, regardless of what you guys just decide to do, I mean, it's it's your life, your sled, but um, definitely don't recommend running the really loud one. Uh, a lot of landowners get upset, and they will shut the trails down, and that doesn't make anyone happy. Um, I definitely won't run that one, not on the trail, if I entered like a drag race or a, a hill climb race or something like that where it wasn't an issue, then absolutely. But I definitely wouldn't run the loud one. I run the quiet one. Um, again, it's definitely a different tone than factory, but it's definitely not much louder. You hear, it's like a raspier sound. Um, it's not, it's really not loud. A lot of guys don't even know that I have one on there until I pull the panel off. They're like, wow, I didn't think that thing had anything on it. Well, that's why. So, um, again, big shout out to Straight Line Performance for making awesome products. You guys have, you know, I've told you guys a million times that I think they're, you know, their products are great. The fit and finish of them are great. So, um, you know, if you guys need anything, definitely go over to the website. Again, my promo code is Bonaduce2022. Uh, save you guys a couple pennies at checkout, but, uh, that's going to do it guys. Make sure to like, make sure to subscribe and I'll see you guys in the next one. Mm -hmm.